Monaco is a tiny city-state located on the French Riviera, and it is one of the richest countries in Europe. Here to both break our hearts and share with you guys a little something, something about the billionaire lifestyle of Monaco, today we'll be talking about lavish hotels and pristine restaurants that billionaires like to frequent. To give you a feel of what it's like to be a billionaire in Monaco, a place where there are more billionaires per head than anywhere else in the world, we will also be talking about all the hottest parties and events to be at, and billionaire citizens to know about. Is there really no poverty in Monaco? Apparently not. The World Factbook by the CIA records rates of poverty around the world for different countries. Well, you may be surprised to find out that in this list, for the part regarding the population in Monaco living below the poverty line, instead of a number being given, it says that the country is not applicable. Of course, this is partially the case because they don't have income tax, and so there's no real way of measuring the income of the residents. At the same time, the city-state is so intensely wealthy that there's basically no poverty to be recorded. Monaco is surrounded by France on three sides, and its official language is French, too. But if we were to use the French definition to discuss poverty, it would mean that poverty is living on an income of approximately 1,000 euros per month. This is around $1,100. That way, as explained by Bakar Chiva, it would be safe to assume that Monaco has a 0% poverty rate. Also, according to another professor of economics based in the International University of Monaco, shared that there are currently no nationals in the country who might be living below the poverty line. The entirety of Monaco is smaller than New York City's Central Park, and it hosts some of the fanciest events on an annual basis, which we're going to discuss in a moment. Living Situation in Monaco there are a total of 38,300 people living in Monaco. Out of these, nearly 9,326 belong to the city-state and are native Monegasque. Other than that, a large majority of people are foreign residents who come from all over the world, including Russia, Germany, Italy, the UK, the US, and Switzerland, etc. And due to there being a natural selection process at play, only wealthy foreigners end up moving to Monaco. Most Expensive Hotels in Monaco Built in 1864, the legendary Hotel de Paris Monte Carlo is located near Place du Casino in Monaco. The hotel not only provides exceptional service to its visitors, the choices of accommodation that it has to offer blows away the minds of even the richest people visiting for the first time. With its unique architectural designs and exquisite style featuring colonnades, marble, caryatids, as well as magnificent crystal chandeliers, the hotel screams, or rather whispers very gently, of elegance and lavishness. To help give you an idea of the hotel's significance and class, ever since it was built there have been numerous musical megastars who stayed at the hotel. As if these names including Ella Fitzgerald, Nat King Cole, Elton John, and Frank Sinatra weren't already huge enough, the hotel also includes a specific suite to pay homage to former actress and princess of Principality, Ms. Grace Kelly. Fairmont Hotel in Monte Carlo is one of the largest luxury hotels in the entirety of Europe. It is situated at the center of Monaco's Principality, and faces the Mediterranean Sea. Hotel Fairmont also has gorgeous contemporary rooms, and it faces the Grand Prix circuit for Formula One racing. Celebrities and all sorts of rich folk, billionaires included, tend to flock to this hotel. One of the most famous attractions in Fairmont Monte Carlo is their in-house casino. The hotel is definitely an attraction for several celebrities, too. And how can we talk about the billionaire lifestyle of Monaco and not mention the beautiful Hotel Hermitage? This place is sure to make anyone who stays there feel like royalty. It has, as its biggest selling point, the intimate atmosphere that it provides, with obviously a view of the Mediterranean Sea. This hotel is exquisitely elegant, yet has a modern ambience to it. This hotel is also located merely 200 meters away from the infamous Casino de Monte Carlo, and has a 7,000 square meter spa, as well as a winter garden. Casino de Monte Carlo Speaking of the billionaire lifestyle of Monaco, Casino de Monte Carlo was the first ever building constructed for Monaco, and the town grew around it. It holds serious significance. 
Millions are won and lost inside the premises of these rooms. And when somebody wins, they don't have to walk past the public to leave the casino. They can simply take one of the secret doors leading to private elevators, which take folks right outside, avoiding any form of interaction with the general public whatsoever. Lavish Restaurants Famous French chef Yannick Leno has a restaurant at Hotel Hermitage Monte Carlo with the same name as his, which offers Michelin star cuisine. And truth be told, the food is just as exquisite as the gorgeous views which can be seen from the terrace. With delicacies such as aubergine caviar, candied rhubarb, and barbecued lobster, we know just how fancy this place can be. Another amazing restaurant is located inside Hotel de Paris, and it is Alain Ducassis Rococo Fortress Le Louis XV. The place is the only restaurant in Monaco which offers three Michelin star service. It's also regularly voted for being one of the greatest restaurants in the world, and it is the most iconic place in Monaco to be. Major Exclusive Events Monaco's Grand Prix is one of the annual events that billionaires love to attend. This competition has international importance and is one of the most prestigious sports festivals to take place around the world. It attracts numerous sports fans and rich folk who simply love a good reason to watch car races and drink. The Grand Prix track is actually visible from the Hotel Fairmont. Another exclusive not-to-be-missed event in Monaco is its Yacht Show. The event occurs annually, and it welcomes THE most expensive and prestigious yachts from around the globe. For the event, MYS curates a wonderful exhibition including around 125 super yachts, and also unveils 45 new models on a yearly basis in a worldwide debut. September is the month to be present in Monaco, to enjoy being on some super yachts with supermodels and whatnot. The Rosé Ball is another annual festival which is considered to be of the highest levels of elegance. It takes place around different times each year, and the attendees celebrate a different theme each time. It attracts some of the biggest names in European high society, and is highly exclusive in nature. The Billionaire Citizens of Monaco since we're talking about how Monaco has the most number of billionaires in the world, let's talk about some of its richest billionaire citizens. In the year 2022, as of now, the richest family residing in Monaco is the Hinduja family. With a net worth of $19.5 billion, the family was also listed at number 55 on Forbes' 2018 The World's Billionaires. Falling at number 2, with a net worth of $16.4 billion, James Ratcliffe is the founder, majority owner, as well as chairman of the chemical powerhouse Ineos Group. Stefano Pessina has a net worth of $11.8 billion and is the third richest person residing in Monaco as of 2022. He owns the world's largest chain of drug stores known as the Walgreens Boots Alliance. That's a wrap for this video. Are you envious of the extravagant lifestyle of Monaco? Because we sure are. Let us know though in the comments below. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one!